23 is the right answer. For this problem, 6 will go into 24 four times and into 18 three times. These just cancel out. 3x is multiplied together over 4x is multiplied together. Everything cancels out except an x on the bottom. So 4 over 3x. Alright, on this one the 30s are gone. You have 4x's multiplied together over 3x's multiplied together, so they cancel out to give you just 1x on the top. You have a y here, but two of them down here. So just a y is left over on the bottom. x over y. Alright, you should have 5 times 4 is 20, and then add your exponents for the x's. 2 and 1 is 3. Plus 1 is 4, plus 2 is 6, 20x to the 6th. I gave you the wrong homework yesterday. It ended up being Algebra 1 that made it to the screen. So if you don't have it today, it's not a big deal. You can do it late and put it in the bucket and still get your 50 points for it. Uh, we only have 7 here today? Yeah, holiday's here. Oh, Holiday's not here, so... 2 out of 7 is uh, a percent of 29, mostly my fault, and Mark Allen. Homework lottery. So Collins and Allen, you can pick a number from 1 to 20, and I'll pick 5 of them. Winning numbers are 1, 6, 10, 13, and 20. Here's a quick multiple choice. Just the block letter is all I need. The answer to this one should be B. Here are the homework answers for Collins and Allen. Number one is 7x minus 5 and 4y plus 3. Two is a plus 8 and 4b plus 3x. 3 is 9a plus 8, 5b minus 9x. 4 is 5x minus 7 and 4y minus 5. 5 is 7x minus 10b and 2y minus a. Number 2? Yeah. How did you break it up? What two terms? That's twenty-four, not x, or not a four, or an a. I should say this is a this is a four. You put an a down. That's where it's at. Yes. Number six is 6a plus 1, 2b minus 5x. 7 is 7x plus 1, 2y plus 9. 8 is what should be in the green. 2a plus 7x and then x plus 1, x minus 1. That's because you have a difference of two squares right here. So you have to break it up like that. And for number 9, 7x minus 2, 3y plus 1. 10 is 7y minus 3, 3x minus 10. Here's a quick review. Say the answer out loud. Factor that out. What should it be? X over y. X over y is right. You have x squared over x cancels to an x. y over y squared cancels to just a y on the bottom. What about number two? 2x two, two two is right. Number three? 2x two two x squared. Thirty x and y Yeah. 
30. 30x to the fourth and y to the second. One over x y, right? Three over two. That's it. Three over two. Y over x to the second is right. Yes. Just X, yes. That's right, 4x. Cross cancel. Negative 6x squared. No, to the 6. Yeah, negative 6x to the 6. All right, everybody pick a number. Winning number is 8. All right, so here's example one. What two terms am I going to start with? Okay, we can start with 5AB and minus 10AX. That's the first group, so the second one would have to be 3B minus 6X. What can I take out of the first group? Uh, 5A. 5A. So what I'll be left with a B minus, minus two, two X. X. All right. What can I take out of the second group? Three, three. A three, and what am I left with? B minus two X. B minus two X. So are these the same quantities? All right. So it's five A plus three, and then B minus two X. Example two, what two terms are you going to use to start with? Uh, x, y minus 5ax. All right, we'll use x, y minus 5ax. That's a good choice. So he, he's doing that to avoid the minus sign. So he's used this one and this one. So now you can do 2by and minus 10ab. What can I take out of the first group? X and be left with what? Y minus 5A. Y minus 5A. What can I take out of the second group? Uh, two, two, B. 2B. And what's left? Not to be. Oh my. <laughs> Not to be. Minus 5A, yes. All right. That's what Bobby Joe said last period. No, that was Smith. That was Smith. She said not to be. She said that too x plus 2b and y minus 5a. On the practice problem, I think I'm going to start with 9xy minus 3ax and then go to the second grouping for this and this, so I have to put a minus sign here and put 6by minus 2ab. Change that sign. So I'll take out a 3x and be left with 3y minus a. And over here take out a 2b and be left with 3y minus 2a. Oh no, not minus 2a, just minus a. So it should be 3x minus 2b and 3y minus a. For the bonus, x plus 2 and x plus 2 cancel out. 
So it's x plus 1 over x minus 1. x plus 3, x plus 3 cancel out, so you're just left with x plus 2 over x plus 4. You can't simplify this any further because the only way you could do it is to factor something out of both of these and both of these. It would have to be the same thing. But you can't factor anything out of x plus 2 except a 1, and that doesn't change anything. Pick a number from 1 to 10. Lottery number is 5. No, no. <laughs> What I'm going to do is start with 4xy minus 6x and then go to 2y minus 3. On the first group, I can take out a 2x and be left with 2y minus 3. But over here, I can't factor anything out. So when I go to my final answer, I still have two quantities that are the same. But what number is right here? 1, One is right, so it should be 2x plus 1 and 2y minus 3. Look at the top. You can factor out a 4 and be left with x plus 2, which cancels with the bottom, so the answer is 4. Try another one, see if you can do that one after you've seen the first one. On the top, you can factor out a 10 and be left with x plus 2. Those cancel, so 10 is your answer. Try one more, see if you can get it. Well, this one you can factor out a 9 on top and be left with an x minus 3, which cancels with the bottom. Fast multiple choice. I need the block letter only. The answer on this one is C. <laughs> on the practice problem, uh, let's see, I'm going to go with 2xy plus 8y and then go minus the quantity of 3x plus 12. You'd have to change that sign on the 12 if you went that way. <clears throat> so I can take out a 2y and be left with x plus 4. And then over here, take out a 3 and be left with x plus 4. So it's 2y minus 3, x plus 4. All right, the answer to the bonus is two. Yes, this is the right homework, yes.